No winners have been declared in three congressional races there. Election officials say they have about 425,000 provisional and mail-in ballots still left to count. Republican incumbent Mimi Walters has a four-point lead right now over Democratic cha challenger Katie Porter in the 48th congressional race. Now let's go to the 39th district now, covering parts of Orange, L.A. and San Bernardino counties. Republican Young Kim is leading Democrat Gil Cisneros by 3,000 votes. And in District 48, Democrat challenger Harley Ruda is leading longtime Republican Congressman Dana Warbucker by a couple thousand votes. Well, Ruda spoke with our Orange County reporter Stacy Butler tonight. That's right. She is live in Santa Ana with the latest on that race and others also in Orange County. Stacy. Yeah, Jeff and Susie, these are just a couple, as you've pointed out, of the very close races that we probably won't know the results of for weeks. The OC Register's office here, well, they have to count over 400,000 ballots before uh, the next couple weeks. It's a tight race, and we knew that all along. <laughs> And we think at the end of the day, I'm going to win somewhere between one and three percentage points. Confident of a win, Democrat Harley Ruda is over 3,000 votes ahead of incumbent Republican Dana Rohrbacher in the race for the 48th congressional district seat. We got to count a little bit more of the votes, and when we are able to make a solid decision, we will announce. According to the OC Registrar of Voters, the 48th district is just one of the races that's so close, a final tally may take weeks. That's because 420,000 ballots still aren't counted, amounting to nearly 40% of all votes cast. So far, each batch of ballots counted today have only added to Ruta's gain over the GOP incumbent. Same goes for Supervisor Todd Spitzer. He campaigned to clean up the Orange County District Attorney's Office, marred by scandal and criticism. He now has likely an insurmountable lead of over 30,000 votes. Spitzer is gaining so steadily. Today, veteran DA Tony Rakakis wrote this letter to his staff, saying, I am honored to have had the opportunity to serve as Orange County's District Attorney for five terms since being elected in 1998. As for a victory or a concession speech, Rakakis hasn't responded to interview requests. Rohrbacher's staff said he won't make a statement until the backlog of ballots is counted. Until then, Ruta and Spitzer will have to wait. It's a little too early, uh, but we're getting closer every day. Harley Ruta said that he is hopeful that he will be able to make an announcement sometime next week. But the OC Registrar of Voters told me that they're expecting the results to all come in after Thanksgiving. That's the very latest from Santa Ana. Back to you guys in the studio. All right, Stacy, thank you.